Papito, okay? Nice job, everybody. If you don't know how a song goes, that's all right. Because all you have to do is just repeat after me, okay? Here we go. mission of OMB is we create and perform interactive theater for chronically ill children and children with disabilities. And we allow them to simply be kids with someone who's not a doctor, who's not a nurse, just simply kids being kids. The actors and actresses get in and, and get involved with the kids and get on their level and talk with them and, and connect with them and, and do a great job every time. When I was this trainee actress, we did go and perform for a school for special needs. The kids, as we were leaving, said, when are you coming back? Oh, what a sweet apology. I will give you two. <laughs> <laughs> the idea of coming back consistently actually provides this kind of um, connection for the kids with the actors. Here comes that actor again, so if they wanted to try something that first time and they were kind of maybe shy or embarrassed, they now have another opportunity. Welcome to OMB Airlines, where our destination today is... Coconut Island! <laughs> Mama came in and Mama did the big butt move and the kids fell out of the chair. From that point on, it was, is Anthony coming? They remembered him. He showed them that it was okay to be silly. good. So, and they are amazing people. They have good shows and they're amazing people. They yeah. me the Do you remember the song, Leo? Oh. <laughs> oh. oh. I believe. I believe in make believe. Put this one on. Can I help you? Yes, nice. I like it. Catherine is nonverbal. She uses an iPad for communication. The photo on her iPad of her self portrait was a photo of her participating in um, Only Make Believe, and she had a princess tiara on, and the feather boas, and she had some jewelry on her, and she was able to participate with her speech pathologist, and I found out through the speech pathologist that she requested all of those items on her own. Um, which is really, I mean, we were all kind of laughing that she just kind of decided that she was the princess who she thinks she is <laughs> and was able to kind of bring that out. Danny, look at the Wait a second. Um, Good choice. <laughs> on the top, on the high wire, it's Wonder Boy Mickey Circus Star. Are you ready? Here we go. Your turn. All right, go ahead. Come walk all the way to this. Yes. Oh, 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 careful. Oh, look at her go. Oh, she's doing tricks. Kids love it. I never thought that I would see them using some of those skills like imagination and, and being able to walk a tightrope today was just so amazing for balance and for creativity. Yeah. Dina's 
She's the little uh, engine that could, you know. She's the, exactly, the she's cannon the, does. She's, and, and she's, you know, sometimes she's in the front of the train pulling everybody back, and sometimes she's the caboose, you know, giving you a push from the rear, you know. She grew up in an orphanage in London, and I think she really understands what it's like to feel out of place and, and longing to be somewhere else. Have we become more political as time has gone on? I think inevitably we have, in as much as that we are now working with populations that I wasn't aware existed before, which is working with the migrant children. No con manzana. No con manzana. No con ciruela. No con ciruela. Pero con plátanos. Pero con plátanos. We see this as a new opportunity to kind of, uh, a new audience to branch into, um, who, are, who are here from various circumstances, mm -hmm. but really, really enjoy the show. When Dina had the simple idea of combining the, her love of kids with her love of theater, uh, and came up with only make-believe, uh, <laughs> Well, I just fell in love with the, the idea and, and the whole concept when I saw it in action in a hospital. Miracles occur. We have the corporate supporters, so, you know, whether they give us a sponsorship for our annual gala or do a corporate volunteer event where they help us make the costumes. We believe in make believe. I'm thrilled and very grateful to Disney for their enormous generosity to only make believe and their continuing support for this wonderful program. We really do change little kids' lives who've started life off with a really bad hand dealt to them. So as a friend of mine said, you know, people always say yes to only make believe. The only question is how big a yes it is. Mom, just massive congratulations on such a like, huge accomplishment, 20 years. I'm very proud of you, and I'm sure Dad's incredibly proud of you. If you fall in love with the kids tonight, uh, be generous. Happy birthday. Only make believe. I absolutely pray and hope it goes on for another 20 years. It's magic at its core. I believe in only make believe. Well, I'd like to think we've only just begun, <laughs> actually, because there's always more to do. I believe in make believe. Thank you so much for coming to our show. And you get to keep your hat.